The topic at tonight's Cedarburg School Board meeting was whether masks should continue to be required in schools. But the meeting itself was paused because of the number of people in attendance who weren't wearing masks on school grounds. Casey Cronus is live in Cedarburg tonight. And Casey, the school year has 30 days left and parents want an answer. And Ted, it may be a while until they get that answer. The public comment portion of this meeting just wrapped up within a minute ago. After more than two hours, the board expected to begin their discussion soon, but things got off to a rocky start when the board president called the meeting into recess, asking the 20 or so audience members who were not wearing masks to comply with the district's current mandate to do so. After more than 30 minutes at a standstill and a handful of people left to mask up, the Cedarburg School Board meeting Tuesday was called back into order with more than three dozen community members waiting to speak during the public comment portion. While the board may take action on its current mask mandate Tuesday, they aren't required to do so. It's an issue that is sending sparks flying among parents and students on both sides. Some who believe masks should be optional in the classroom. Others who feel it would be unsafe to remove the mask requirement. Masking should be a parental choice. You're the leaders we depend on to make tough decisions in the best interest of our children. Please do not wait to see what nearby districts are doing or politicized government entities are recommending. We don't need outside entities telling us as parents how we should think or care for ourselves and our children. Kids under 16 can't get the vaccine yet. We are not there. The County Public Health Department, the Wisconsin Department of Health Services, the CDC, and countless others in the medical community all recommend that schools keep their policies in place. This topic drew dozens of community members to the field house tonight, many of them not going anywhere as they anxiously wait to find out if the board will even take action tonight and if they do, what they will decide. Reporting live in Cedarburg, Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. We'll let you get back to it, Casey. Thank you.